What's going on, guys? I'm back again. Um, appreciate the views on the video for the Betts uh, gold jersey review. I'm back again. Um, so what I what I can't usually find on 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 YouTube, it's probably there, but a more recent one. What's the difference between an authentic and a replica? Well, I'm here to do my little small video. Um, as you can see here, um, this is Authentic Bets, uh, gold trim jersey. So one that everybody's been looking for. Uh, definitely real, definitely authentic. Uh, got it at a store. I was first in line. Uh, it's, it's a 48. They had one size in 48, which was crazy to me. And um, But I was I was there first in line and I, I got it. Which is well, which is awesome. Um, Kershaw the goat. Um, this is a great jersey to have to your collection if you don't have it. Um, I haven't got his authentic yet because he is going to retire a Dodger. I know, so I got to get that Hall of Fame jersey um, once he is retired. Um, but back back to the main video purpose. Uh, what's the difference? Um, they both look the same. You can see, I mean, but, uh, main, there's a lot of main differences. I'm going to break down really real quick. Uh, the, the main part is, um, authentic Jersey is, is, is the name. There's, there's authentic and there's replica, right? There, there's, I, a lot, I, sometimes I see online, you know, there's, oh, this is the authentic, um, on field Jersey. And then versus this, oh, this is just authentic. I'm just like, no, no, no. The, the, the real name, this is Authentic Jersey, this is Authentic On-Field Jersey. I could give this to Mookie Betts tonight and he can wear this tomorrow. Um, versus this is a replica, it's made um, just to have a replica, re replica of his name and number. Um, but nothing else. Um, uh, one, one of the main differences here, you can see here, obviously stitched. Um, Every number, every name, every piece of the name has the end of the stitch where the machine stops and they cut it. Um, a lot of people, you know, take a, um, a a lighter to it or they'll get like little clippers and clip it. I like to keep mine personally like this because it looks, to me, it looks a lot more cooler. Um, over here, you know, in the replica, it's basically uh, written on, um, not written on specifically, but it's uh, it's fake stitches, right? This is pressed on. Um, if you look under it, uh, you know, under it versus the replica, you know, you're going to see stitches, right? Boom. Versus um, this one, you're not. Another big difference, too, is, is the material. Um I'm not too sure of exact what material the authentic is, but uh, it is an elastic, almost uh, stretchy material. I know uh, it's made of two, you can see here, uh, and extra length. So these are both large jerseys. 48 runs large. Obviously a large replica is just a large replica. Both the same size, um, but one's longer, right? Uh, the, um, this one has a little bit extra length here. Uh, this is used for when the players tuck it in. That's why this is on. This is there's there's only one one way to call it. It's a replica jersey. Um, I get tired of seeing those names online. Another thing uh, that's really uh, noticeable: the number. Uh, authentics have the number. Replicas don't. Um, another thing that the authentics have, the replicas don't, is going to be the LA. So over here, this is obviously a special jersey. So you got the seven symbol for seven time world champs. But over here, you have nothing. It's a blank sleeve on both sides, usually both sides. Uh, but this is the special World Series champion edition for Kershaw. Um, and I believe on this one, it's usually blank. Or they'll have a patch or so. Um, so right now we have the uh, the Don student patch, and um, uh, don't quote me, but I, well, there's another one that I'm uh, dragging on my head right now. Um, basically, those are the two differences between these jerseys. 
Obviously, uh, this one is going to run you close to 300, 350 versus a replica is going to run you about 100 to 150, depending on the occasion. Uh, this, this one was 150 because of the, the championship. Uh, usually they run around 110, depending where you go, 110, 120, 130. Uh, this one, um, a little bit more expensive because of the uh, rarity of, of this jersey. I don't think they're going to do another restock. I think this is it. Um, but uh, just wanted to do a little breakdown of uh, two jerseys, one authentic, one replica. Um, uh, some people <clears throat> don't know or don't understand. Uh, you know, one more thing too. Uh, 48 runs large, right? So you got two large, like I said. They're both the same size. One's a little bit longer. This gets tucked in. Um, and then these don't run in, in numbers. So that's what I think too. You're gonna see um, 48, 46, 44, 42, right? I believe. Uh, small, medium, large, extra large. Uh, big differences here. Uh, it's a great to have a replica. I, I don't hate on them, but it's nothing like having an authentic. Um, Little side note to end, to end the video. I'm not a big fan of the uh, knockoff jerseys. Um, so one thing you can tell uh, lately that I've been seeing uh, knockoff jerseys. Uh, if you're looking for a real one, you know, you got to do your research because a lot of the knockoffs look real good nowadays. Um, but uh, the D between the O and the D, you're going to notice this little dash is huge on other, on other jerseys. It looks like it says do jurors you know uh definitely another crazy thing you see the numbers are either really really skinny or they're so fat that it looks like it's taking up the whole back um this one this is did you see anything bigger than the 50 uh you know it, it, it's just crazy sometimes this will be a big old five all the way up here and a zero um but small differences, uh, but but big ones that, you know, stand out. Um, but uh, thanks, guys, for listening. Uh, I'll be posting another video soon. Thanks.